I'm so excited to get to play the Blue Engine Thomas. I remember being a kid and being so excited to go to Shining Time Station and enjoy all the time with all the engines. And it's especially great to get to be the one lucky enough to play Thomas. I'm absolutely thrilled to be a part of this. My niece and nephew, Ava and Ben Karsh, are huge fans of Thomas the Tank Engine, so I'm dedicating my performance to them today. Thomas the Tank Engine has been a massive part of my life. When I was a child, I was obsessed with it. Um, and pretty much, I think I had every single one of them in toy form. Uh, so I'm very excited and thank you so much uh, for asking me to be part of this. Now, when I was about your age, when I was a lot younger, my favourite was Thomas the Tank Engine, and it still is. So I would never miss up the opportunity to be part of Thomas the Tank Engine and be part of this amazing show. So I want you to sit back, relax, have fun, sing along and enjoy. And we will see you after the show. Bye! I'm so excited to be a part of this because I have a three-month-old daughter and I cannot wait to introduce her to all the characters on the island of Sodor and Shining Time Station and be a part of the legacy that is Thomas. My uh, relationship with Thomas um, is with my son Oliver who, who loved him and we had a Thomas the Train table downstairs so I've, I've logged many an hour uh, voicing all the, all the trains of, of, of the kingdom um, and uh, it's a big part of my life um, and thrilled to be doing this. I'm very excited to be a part of yet another Thomas show. I've done several with this particular organization. We did a touring library show uh, to celebrate Thomas's birthday and it was so much fun. Um, my character wore overall, so I just, I had to bring that back. <laughs> I think I've seen almost every episode of the original Shining Time Station. My brothers and I were huge fans growing up. We loved Mr. Conductor and all of the silly adventures Thomas and his friends got themselves in. So I am thrilled to be a part of this. I'm a longtime fan of Thomas the Tank Engine and Friends, and I'm pumped to be part of telling this story for all of you. I've been a fan of Thomas since I was little, watching Shining Time Station as a kid. And who would have thought five years ago I would be in a production all about Thomas the Tank Engine, uh, playing Riley in the original version we did, and I am so proud of that role. And I am super excited to continue helping with these Thomas projects. I used to have so much Thomas the Tank Engine stuff as a kid. I remember having a full extended train set. It had all the characters from Thomas, and... I remember used to playing with it all the time and reenacting all the Thomas stories that they would tell on Shining Time Station. And there's just something so lovable about Thomas, how joyful, cheerful, motivational, and playful he is. It's pretty neat for me because uh, my son's 20 right now, but when he was younger, when he was little, uh, we, he was a huge Thomas fan and we watched Thomas and the Magic Railroad on DVD quite a lot. So uh, it's really exciting to be part of this. So thank you very much and hope you enjoy. For 10 years, I've been the voices in the television series of Thomas and Friends of Sir Topham Hatt, or the Fat Controller, as he's known in the UK, um, Gordon, Edward, Henry, uh, many others actually do quite a lot. And um, I'm very pleased to be asked to do this for you today. I'm very excited about this because James will be the first person to be in my house for about three months, which is incredible, isn't it? James, who is the fastest red engine on Sodor. Now, if you didn't know that, I'm very surprised because James is extremely fond of telling people. Anyway, have a good time. Enjoy the show. <laughs> 